here's an example. When I am in front of the orchestra, everything falls into perfect harmony. It's like I am a magician and everything just comes into perfect harmony. When, when I am on the front, everything happens like magic. See? No, you're doing something special. Something special. But what is that? You have to tune into it. It's not in here. It's in here. You have to, your eyes have to sparkle like that. You see all these great sopranos and the great directors and the great composers have something in their eyes. Show me your eyes. Your, your heart has to come out through your eyes. You have to train your heart, open your heart so that your eyes reflect your heart. You know, they, they say that. The, the eyes show the soul. So what makes your soul come alive? No, love. love. What do you hear in music? Love. Not music. Music is boring. You can show me all these notes on the keyboard. How, how is that going to make your heart come alive? No. What happens when you're listening to music? You remember about love. No? Or you remember God. Or you remember the beauty of life. It's all love. <laughs> I will make you Karayan, that's for sure. I will make you Karayan. I'm a lover. I'm a lover. You come up all these, the Sufis, they're lovers. <laughs> Show me the love. Go give the world love. Oh, when people look in your eyes, what do they see? Pure love. You have to own that. Don't doubt that. When I am in front of the audience, People remember about love. People remember about beauty. I help them to remember the beauty of life, the love, the poetry, the music. This is why everybody writes music, is to remind us of love, of beauty. Because if you're not in music and you look at your shitty life, put your headphones on and you're like, oh, thank God, this is so much better. That's why they come to you. You're like a doctor. They come in for the injection. Oh, open your heart. Remember me. And in your eyes, give them love. Show them again. It will remind you that music reminds us that we are love, that, we, the whole, that life is beautiful, that everything around us is beautiful. And the ego, the nafs, makes everything ugly. Me and my problem and this and that. And it's all bullshit. It's in my heart. It's in my blood. I come alive, my heart, everything is forgotten about. Show every instrument becomes love. <laughs> because really, right now, uh, uh, you know, not joking around, people need this so much. They need to be reminded, and you tell them, that music reminds us to not take life so seriously, to experience the beauty, the majesty. And people love that. They will... Anything... Never mind what you play. People say, I love this man. I love him. Why? Because they love themselves. It's not because they love you. They love themselves because you reminded them of the love that's in them. You become a lover now. I mean, show me the love. It opens your heart to do more of that, whatever it is. The certain kind of music for me, like a cello, opens my heart. I love listening. Whatever it is, just... And put your hand over your heart. Let you feel your heart. Let it come alive. It will guide you. It will, it will change your life. And your problems will all become love also. Dance, sing, open your heart. Write music. Write poetry. Write. Just fall in love for this week. Who You are allowed to fall in love. You know, I have to give my clients permission to fall in love. They don't know. They, they think, oh, really? You give me? Oh, oh thank you. You can love, love everything, all your problems, everything. Love, I give you permission. Okay. Forget about all the bullshit, man. For one week or one yes. day is caused by holding on to too much bitterness. Where's the sweetness? That's the problem. He's showing you, you don't have sweetness, you have too much bitter. Get rid of all the resentment and the anger and the frustration and more love, more generosity. Go, go give the world music. That's your job. Give the world love.